What is up guys, Polder here, bringing you a uh, another Cypher unboxing. It's been a bit since like middle of last August. Um, and I still have the same three booster boxes still to open from that one. But I also got, because we're blind on them, um, one of the new starter decks. Or newer. There's one before this that I forgot, so I actually don't own it. I need to get that. So this is the... The Three Houses booster or starter deck uh, from set 12. There's the set 11 starter deck, and um, I don't have it, so we're gonna have to. <laughs> I'm gonna have to get that, and then we're gonna jump backwards, I guess, because the last booster box I opened was set 13. CC. <laughs> kind of all over the place, um, but they also just recently announced Cypher is stopping. I think after the 20th set, it's. Um, that's gonna be it. That's really sad. Um, Cause I really like opening these, even though I'm extremely, extremely slow at doing so. But fitting that we just finished our three houses um, playthroughs, all four, and uh, perfect time to open this. It's the three houses starter deck. You see Byleth at the front here, with the the, <laughs> the little bear signature. Uh, I'm also recording in a new place, so. There's like glares over there, there's glares over there, I'm gonna have to like figure out the best place to do things. Um, but you can see at the top there, Edelgard, Claude, and Dimitri, and then we got Sothis, we got Flame, and the back has a deck list, but I can't read Japanese, so we're gonna have a nice look on the inside, see all the lovely, lovely art, but let's pop it open. Okay, so... Uh, oh, let's go ahead, peel that back, throw those over there, uh, but okay, there we go. So, as per usual with these Cypher starter decks, uh, you get your chunk of hollow promos, versions of the, uh, of other cards in here. So, of course, the one at the start there, uh, with the little signature. I'm trying to get a good image of the signature without this giant glare. Uh, oh, there we go. There we go. I love that the artist had a little, little teddy bear signature. That's adorable. Um, but there is Byleth. Female Byleth. I don't know if both Byleths are in this or not. You can see here's another Byleth. A more unpromoted version. And then all... This this exact card should be unhollow in the deck somewhere. And the hollows tend to be very, very dark. So it should be easier to see detail and backgrounds. There's an Edelgard that looks looks to be a promoted Edelgard, might not be. I guess cause I think this is like class arc. Like it's not green hair by left. So I don't think we'll see any time skip designs in this. There ooh. Okay, very blue. All right, a lovely Dimitri. I like that. Uh, oh, I'm getting ahead of myself. We have Claude. Oh, I like how how his like cape, sleeve, things are all flayed out. Oh, and there's like an arrow that's like whizzing by too. Alright, um, and then Edelgard gets two, apparently. Okay, so here's uh, a different Edelgard. I actually really like this this art. Hold on, I want to grab this, this uh, first hollow Edelgard. They look like different artists. They might actually be, uh, if you see Illustrator, they are. Aha, uh -huh. this, this one. I quite like this one. All right, so those are the fancy hollow that uh, hollows that you get. Uh, but now we'll see. You can see. I mean, it's a starter deck, so there's like multiples of different things. So here is this the one that was? Yeah, this is the one that was at the at the front, just not hollow, no signature, and no foil to uh, mess with the colors. So you see it in all of its glory. Man, I'm gonna be so sad. 
because Cypher, I'm sure it's far, far more expensive to produce. You get three of those. Um, but they recently said that because or Cypher was made to hold things over uh, between games, like main video games, um, here's an unhollow of this, but Fire Emblem Heroes uh, now fits that role, so they're canceling the Cypher. But the, the art quality is not the same. A lot of the... You get two Sothis here. A lot of the artists in Fire Emblem Heroes do also make cards for the Cypher. But, I don't know, whenever... It, a PNG versus a full illustration, there's just no comparison. And... Ugh. Ugh, like, the logistics behind it makes sense, but I'm still, still upset. I mean, of course, I could have been one of the people, because I know there are, that were just waiting to get into this, hoping it would come to the West. There's three of these, so here's a, a non-holographic version of the, the Flames Edelgard card. I'm trying not to turn over there, because that's where the light is, clearly. <laughs> Nice. But I'm also curious what's gonna happen to the price of these. Because, I mean, ideally, I only get one Dimitri, so you get three. Okay, so clearly this is a very Edelgard biased deck. It had two hollows. She gets three of those. There's one Dimitri and only one Claude. Here's the non-hollow of that. See a lot more detail coming through there. Uh, oh, fl oh, flame in the greenhouse. Okay, get two of these. I like that. I, w I was just saying something, and I completely <laughs> lost track of my thoughts. Uh, I think it would- I, I might have finished my thoughts? I don't know, I was just very sad. And here's another of the, uh, the second Edelgard. You get one non-hollow of them. I really like this one. It's such a good card art. Uh, alright, on to new characters that we have not seen yet. We get three of these Huberts. And the plus side of um, this being fresh off of, you know, all three houses stuff, I shouldn't forget anyone's name, which tends to be a running theme. There's at least one person that I can't recognize or can't remember their name of doing, like, the uh, the booster boxes in the back here. Just because it's, you know, depending on what... Uh, oh, there's only one here. Depending on what, you know, games are com they're comprised of. It's like, oh, it's been a hot minute since I played that. Uh, but one Ferdinand Von Eyer promoted, uh, and then you get three unpromoted versions. His hair here looks like Judge Judy, um, which I think this is the same person who did Ferdinand for the Fire Emblem Cypher art, and I feel like he looks like Judge Judy in, <laughs> or I said Cypher, uh, in Fire Emblem Heroes. I feel like he looks like Judge Judy there too. Uh, but <laughs> there's that. Uh, you get two. Oh, I just saw someone. I'm happy he's here. Uh, two of these. Bernadetta. I hate her, but Cypher Art's good. Cannot deny that. Uh, moving on, we get two Dorotheas. It looks like this. The deck is um, in order of house, so. These are the last, potentially, of uh, the Black Eagles. It's Dorothea. Uh, and then, Dimitri gets another card. Okay, he just doesn't get another hollow card. So Claude probably also has a second card too. This Dimitri art, I really like this one. I mean, I like the, the other one, the action scene, but this one's really good too. I quite like it. Next, my mans. 
Uh, and this is going... Oh, this is going up on... It is Dead Tuesday right now. It is a Tuesday. Praise Dead Tuesday. We have three Dedu cards out here in the greenhouse. Bless. Watering the plants. So good. So good. Completely unbiased. I promise. That's a lie. Um, <laughs> next up... Ooh, oh, this is like the best of both worlds. Holy shit. So this looks like promoted... I gotta remember, the light is behind me, so whenever I move my hand up, <laughs> I'm creating a shadow. Um, this looks like the outfit she wears when she's promote or in time skip, but has the long hair. Oh my god, good Mercedes card. Because I know there's like some uh, there's like split between short hair and long hair Mercedes. Me. Two unrolled cats. Oh. oh my god. Look at that one. What's he got? Hold on, I gotta put that up to my face. I don't think he's got anything. He's just he's got a, a gray speck on his chest. I don't know. And then a black cat and then like a tabby cat. Oh I love him. I love him. Bless. Uh next up. We got three, yep, we got three Ingrids to round out the black, the blue lions. <laughs> three of these. Just a Ingrid chilling on a wall. That's what it looks like. Pegasus in the background. Very nice art. Uh, all right, and then we're moving on. Oh my God, I saw the next card. We're moving on to Claude. So here's Claude's secondary artwork from this deck. Not bad. I do actually like his his main one. I guess the hollow one, the promoted one more. There's Claude. <laughs> and moving on to the rest of the Golden Deer. Uh, next up we have <laughs> Raphael. There are two of these. Um, Raphael's stuffing his face with food. Sandwich. Uh, he's got some sort of look like meat pie. Uh, mutton drumstick there's some some bread down there some bananas an apple oh my god <laughs> that is so good uh then we have two lysithias two of these casting some fire ready for the death knight all right very cute not angry you know, like, when I think of Lysithia, I think more so of her just like, how dare you, attitude. Like, how dare you call me little. But it was very, very solemn art. And we got Hilda. Fucking love Hilda. Very good art here. Bless. There's only one of those. Uh, then we got... Oh, oh, the last three. These starter decks, very short. But, I mean, that's the nature of a Star Deck. The final three cards in here. We have Leonie. Uh, what is happening? What is she attacking? Like she's attacking... Something armored and their heads pop... I, is it a dummy? Is it training? There's chandeliers above her, so I'm going to assume this is, like, in the training area. But good old Leonie. Really like Leonie. Uh, and then... As with every starter deck, you know, wait, did I miss it? Or did they, oh, no, I missed it, alright. With every starter deck, you get this last card, um, on it, I believe it says Hero, and it's just used for, like, dividers in card boxes and whatnot. Uh, nothing, nothing else, just that. But, I did forget, you know, I'm using one down here, I was about to say, wait a minute, there's something else I'm forgetting, it just didn't come out, because I didn't pull it out. With every starter deck, you get that card. You get, of course, update. Oh, look at the, like, full on, like, art of the Edelgard card. All right. My, uh, camera view is not very tall, so I'm gonna kinda squish it in here. Uh, but yeah, of course, tells you how to play in the most recent, this is version 1.9. Um, and then you get the same thing. 
with a play mat. What is this? Oh! Oh! Now again, because the... What I can actually fit in the camera um, isn't that big. can kind of maybe see... It's like... I don't actually know if this is a... It looks like a Fire Emblem Heroes map, and it's definitely Fire Emblem Heroes assets. But as far as like what map, it's if it's supposed to represent a map within three houses, I don't... I can't recognize what it's supposed to be. Uh, but cool that there's like an actual scene. Normally it's just a color. So like the one down there, it's not in focus right now because I'm in macro, but it's just a... Uh, just a color with some fancy decoration. So that's a neat little change up. But it has, you know, all your, your card slots and everything in it. Holds up nicely and then has a, you know, quick play guide on the back. But there we go. That is going to do it. Nice little Cypher starter deck. Uh, I need to get my hands on the one that we passed for set 11. That is called Warriors of Bonds. It's like an all-star deck, it looks like. I have a pulled up on my computer behind me. It has Lucina on the front, and then I see Art of Marth and Ike. I'll probably put the, the preview picture on the screen. I need to pick that one up, uh, which might be hard, considering the state of the world right now. I can't say the C word. Uh, <laughs> you do don't like the C word. But, um, yeah. I gotta try and get that. But also, especially since we're kind of in a, in a weird spot um, with the Fire Emblem games right now, uh, I would like to try and open 14 over here on the left, so I shake the entire table and camera. Um, Soon-ish, TM, with how these Cypher videos tend to go, though, um, we shall see. I would like to do it soon. Um, whether, ha how soon, I don't, I don't know. <laughs> but that is going to be it. Thank you all for watching. Hopefully you enjoyed. Nice starter deck. Nice little uh, welcome back to, to Cypher stuff. And uh, yeah, I'll see you guys next time.